Yep, what's good job, ladies, gentlemen, kings, queens, how y'all doing, how y'all feeling today? We got seven MIC drill rappers that got betrayed by their own gang. The, the fact that that's the title that we're reading right now is nuts. Saddening, actually. Hold on, this candle, hold on, give me, give me two seconds. That bitch went all the way down, I had to make sure, you know what I'm saying? You know, nigga was safe. Oh, let me be careful. She got oils and shit. I don't know how the fuck candles work. Damn, not a bit smoking. All right, hold on, watch out on me. Yep. Yeah. All right, man, let's get to this video though, bro. That crazy title, EBK Tino. What's good, bro? Dodd me. What's good, y'all? It's Big we EBK. We ain't giving no daps. Backdoor, in yeah. Today's video. See, Look. this nigga be spoiling shit. Okay, hurt. I didn't say backdoor. My bad. Betrayed. Uh, well, obviously, Nazi BK. Which I mean, if you know, then you know. But this nigga be having the shit up already, so it's like. You can guess who we got up first. We're going to be okay. taking a look at New York drill rappers that got betrayed low. by their own gang. Let's go. get into it. The first Indeed. drill rapper on the list is Bronx rapper Nas EBK. Yep. Nas is a part of the D.O. crew, the D. same o. crew as K. Flock. Before Nas clicked up with K, he hung out with the OGs in Cortland. Some of those pe Wait, hold on, hold on. people being CJ. He hung out with I'm like who's who in this flick? Obviously Shy K, okay, B dot. Which which is Nas even is this? I don't know who this is. He looked like Shimi, that's funny as fuck. I don't know who this is. I don't know. PJ? He looked familiar too. Alright, nah, let's just get to it. I don't know, bro. I don't know, I don't know why I'm about to act like I know. Who, Some of who? those people being CJ Goon. Shaw E.K. and P.J. Glizzy. I just heard recently that, uh, I think it was actually in an interview that this thing actually wasn't cool with, uh, Shaw E.K. Or Shaw E.K. wasn't cool with him, so. <laughs> Miss info, E.P.K. Tino. With K, he hung out with the <laughs> OGs bullshit. in Cortland. I'm not Some joking, of those people being C.J. Goon, Shaw E.K. and P.J. Glizzy. Nuz used to chill on a block often and began to build a relationship with the O's, serving them wedding cake runs on the regular. And what, what was the reason? Why no. wasn't no. cool with you? That's what be trying to tell me to be around, not knowing, just trying to be damn. Oh. It looked like you cool the whole time. I'm trying to do that to you before that happened. Crazy, to you. by the way. Okay. It just was never the right Crazy time. Crazy, Bob. Gotcha. Say, yo, chill. There's chill. He was cool with CJ. Okay. He was. Yeah, I see they cool now. Yeah, you know, still yeah. cool, but. We was on him. I was on him. I dead didn't have no problem with him. Mm -hmm. But he was a that we used to make come three in the morning, come sell us. We don't give him no bread. He just woke up. out was that type of crazy vibes. Until one day, PJ Glizzy decided he spent enough time building a relationship with Nas EBK, and it was time to betray him. PJ invited Nas to a fake party and told Nas to meet up with him at the location. Once Nas got to the location, PJ and the two goons. He was with plan to take everything Nas had. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Just feel me. It was uh, feel me. A couple. Just like yo, let's go to party. I'm like that. Okay. We end up going to the party or whatever, and then that's when shit went left. But it wasn't. It took like twenty. I ain't gonna lie. Or Fifteen. Twenty. Like a real party or? It wasn't even a party. We didn't even get to go to the party. Oh, it was like, yo, we gonna wait for the lift. We out upstairs real quick type of vibe. Got man. you. Feel me? Niggas yeah. got me good. I ain't gonna yeah. lie. Got me good. Rocking me to sleep. It's not my man. So it was like, yeah, yeah. You I didn't think that can happen with people. I didn't think nothing of it. Feel me? Yeah. I was like, feel me? You chill around. Damn near. Or not all the time, but like, you know what I mean? Y'all see each other's all love all the time or whatever. And then he told you, yo, pull up. You gonna pull up? That's me bad vibes, though. Love it. So yeah. feel me, but I had vibes. what I usually walk around with. That yeah. went a whole different way. So it's like I'm. Right. I don't so, know. I so when we was around, every time we was going to hotel parties, one day we was actually gonna do it because he had old. Yeah. I'm not doing it. Yeah. One day, PJ did it on his own. He just did it. Wow. He yeah. said, I, I don't know if I'm. Bugging. He trying to say he lied. He trying to say he was fighting mad. Yeah. Niggas. No, shut up. He was fighting. Two, three, bro. He was not funny, man. Yeah. He pull up, he pulled up right in the hallway. And I guess they start, they start trying to grab the. 
Yeah. He runs downstairs to the next floor, not knowing like he wanted to my man's the floor they was on. Yeah, that's my man's floor, but his family live on the bottom, the next floor under. Yeah, he running downstairs and he's not like knocking on the door. He knocks on the wrong door, so my man's grandma called like I think one of your friends is here, so I have it to him. Yeah, so he like what? One of my friends oh. looking for him. He just disappeared. So he told him like he and my grandma. Oh, oh wow! He, he got caught with him. Oh, that's crazy! Oh, that's crazy! Yeah. He almost got away. Man. After Nas got oh, that's robbed, nasty. he decided to lean towards the Seb side the Oa click and stayed as far as possible from the OGs. That's nasty. I ain't gonna lie. PJ would hop on IG Live and self-incriminate himself, saying this word for word. Oh, yeah, I robbed know. you. I might keep it a buck. I robbed you, gang. Yeah, word to my mother. Cause how you on my? How you on my? You pop, you pop, and I robbed you already. On the nigga pop that you robbed. That's kind of crazy. You pop, you mad pop. Where do my mother? You mad pop? How you say fifteen when that, that really was last? That was like that's last year, homie. Nigga? You pop, bro. Like no funny. Like you really pop, Nas. Like why you even trying to come trying to talk about my? You is pop, bro. Like no funny. Like what you ever do, bro? Like no funny. Bro, I robbed you, bro. I'm gonna keep it a buck. I robbed you, gang. You ain't do shit about it. And I'm in a rose right now. Yeah. You still ain't do nothing about it. I'm in the same place that you could catch me every day in the rose. Nazi BK, you're a bum. Stop mentioning me, bro. No, I know funny fucking me mad, bro. Like, you DOA, I'm DOAK. Like, I getting split back to back to back. Leave me alone. Oh. Nobody cares. I don't remember that part you talking about me and a Harold, Harold Preston. You never even stepped in Harold Preston before in your life. Took my, I'm selling my coat. I was never the type to do that. You heard like, yo, bo, alright. And then on top of that, pay for a pound. What's a pound? A pound of a wedding cake. You dead? Yo, broke, bro. A wedding cake. That's all they got from me. A pound of wedding cake. Congrats. That's two thousand dollars. <laughs> oh my god. I got that back in two days, and y'all own man's gonna vouch for that. CJ Goon watched me get the two bands back in two days. Is that man? Trapping. Or are you just saying that Easy. for the sake of... Come on now. Yeah, nigga, the Validation. most to get two bands. That nigga, six months of building up. Not even Validation. six months. Years. I think it's like a grass. So years of building a relationship with me to get to me. So y'all can rob me for $2,000. Yeah, that's bad vibes. I ain't gonna All lie. Right, bro. All right, bro. How much time have we been on this? One and I had mad pieces that they didn't know what to do with. You got seven I had over 100k in that book bag, but it was in cards. You needed the pin. Click bait, Tino. You didn't know the pin. Tino, Tino. Congrats. Now you're only one two bands. The next drill rapper okay, we're she, going to no, be talking be about is Chapa. EBK Choppa. Choppa is a Don't rapper you. from Middletown that bangs OGs and Jacks Corbin. Just got through this in the last one, bro. Chapa was recently betrayed by his own homies from the gang he claims. He went to the block to chill with them like it was a normal day. Then that's when they decided to sucker punch and jump him. What? I don't know who Why? Why? I said the same shit in the last It's a new wedgie man, you heard? But damn. That's how you know it's real. You the real wedgie man, you heard? You see what happened to your little dumb? I'm not gonna repeat anything I said in the last video. The 300. <laughs> okay, that's just still funny. Yo, so who getting back for Chopper? This nigga really be trolling. Oh, shit. Oh, Chopper. shit. Oh, I speak for the whole New York City drill community. I speak for all of us. We not jacking no OT. We not jacking none of that. We not. Kwani getting belted. See him, I'm telling you. Alright, this part I will repeat. I, I don't I don't know. I, I still don't know why that shit's in the video. What's the over under? In this one too? I ain't gonna lie. Come on, T. Gotta know. get shot. That's the over Come under. Come on, T. Gotta get four shot today. I ain't gonna lie. Heard, that's under. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Heard the watch back. Like, what what am I, I'm not even playing. I ain't gonna lie. What am I I'm not playing. All I got to do is What am I I like that. I like that. 
Cha E K says Choppa got jumped because he was chilling with Shimi and the 300 demons, and he was also smoking on Idak. Did it bother you when you got cool with them, or that was kind of a no, strike against was, him too? Yeah, that was why he got. Was, I'm not gonna lie, if the Edo shit didn't, didn't, if this shit didn't happen off sides, that alone, so like with us then or, him chilling with yeah, them niggas. Even when we was chilling I mean, before, when I'm not trying to defend track, it. I'm telling you, you're not either or. You, know you gotta know who to, how to move. But, you gotta know who to chill with, bro. Anything can happen to you. You just moving dumb. Yeah. <laughs> I never knew you was cool with Shimi, bro. I never knew that. He said he said it like you did. He said, no, I did not. Yeah. And then I right, being cool. Making a song with him, mm. ain't this song that you own? Yeah. Did he? Too far. I don't remember that. Got I you, know that. got you. If he would have told you, like, yo, DK, I ain't gonna lie. Man, it's not only him, man. I'm blocked. Mm. Okay. What was it? What was it about him that made you feel? That like you that? actually linked him and did a song with him. Got you. Like, yeah. Okay. The next drill rapper we're going to talk Black. about is no other than Harlem rapper Blockwork. We about to get a whole, the whole same, same video. from the same place as E.Dot Baby, last time. Didi Osama, Move Look Sugar Hill. He was this is copy and paste, you know, be group. honest. How was he betrayed? In late November, Shaw E.K. and O.Y. rapper Sugar Hill Keem went on the internet calling Blockwork a snitch. Why are they calling him a snitch? I ain't gonna Lockwork skip it and Sugar Hill because it's a part of the video. A taxi together, but you know what I'm saying? If you want the police. full experience, Here's watch a clip of Block Work speaking on the situation. The last Tino video so I did. That down, um, so why do people think you snitch and fuck, get into you? Know, I'm like, gonna lie. I'm trying to hear this all over again. Let me see that. I was in a situation with my man's where he felt like he could try to quote unquote throw at me. You feel me? Sugar Hill King. Yeah. Who's locked up currently, right? So if me, me as a man, you feel me? My pride held, and I denied that. You feel me? And basically, we went on to beef about you know petty bills. On the internet the next day and put out, put out Blockworks a rap. But we got locked up, came home, and we shot Move Look. The shot that we the, that we got out. Yeah. If I snitched on you and you knew that, we just came home and I just paid half your bill to come home, and we all go, we about to fight this case. To, we about to, like, for me, you know it's inset. I snitched on you. Yeah. We came home and shot a music video together. Yeah. If, if, if I you, see Sunny in this shit, like, and it's the same so clips, we're so going to have problems, you know? Shot K, went on the internet, 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 shot K, went on because he was under the same name. Blockwork oh. made songs with For One Dissing his former gang. Until the death of Naughty okay, that might be new. For One made the most disrespectful songs in New York drill history, the Naughty Bop. Although Blockwork wasn't seeing eye to eye with Sugar Hill, he still had love and didn't want any harm to happen to him. So he decided to leave For One and start dissing the making that the second time he was betrayed. Next, we have Bronx rapper Set the Trend. We know. Set the Trend we is know. a rapper that used to be in DOA. He was kicked out of the gang after paperwork came out that he snitched on his passed away mans. J.O. Bands has been the main one pushing the narrative that he's a rap show. This is literally to copy paste, you know. Now I'm tired. I know you remember you was wearing my clothes, Jeremiah. I know you remember that. I know you remember when my auntie Keisha gave up your mall, Jeremiah. I know you remember that. I know you remember that, Jeremiah. Y'all gotta understand. Let's go deep, let's go deep, I'm not let's a nigga that likes to see this same shit over and over. Let's talk about Jeremiah. Let's talk about Jeremiah. So, let's talk about so the last Tino upload I got, I've already seen these clips. The only new one I see is this last one. Let's not forget. I could just get to it, but. He allegedly snitched when he was Actually, 16. Actually, as a matter of so fact. So they knew he was a snitch for a minute now, and they're just now coming out with paperwork. It's kind of strange. Here's a clip of Set the oh, Trend trying to clear his name and say it's all cap. Listen, man, I'ma just like, tell you like, like what's this, going man. on with the f Like, I'm to say that's the reason that's Yeah, it's yeah, we're not doing mad right now, you feel me? Uh, In the very beginning. I fishing. Go. She getting f mm. Last, Bye -bye, at least we got former for one rapper Mo Cardi. Mocardi was a part of 4-1 in the very beginning before they were super lit. Around the time they started gaining traction, according to Cly Rich, he was Cly selling Rich. released <laughs> songs for a bag of chips and sweet tea. I remember this That's era crazy. because I used to post Kyle Rich leaks to get attention to my great content. Mm -hmm. Any who after Mocardi was given a case hey, of bro, I gotta do what you gotta do, homie. demons, after he linked them on some backdoor vibes. Now this shit's low as fuck again. Hold on, bro. I got gotcha. great content. Any who after Mo Cardi was given a case of the beat by the 4-1 Demons after he linked them on some backdoor vibes. 
and get thrown in it. All right, so basically, one of the members, right, in Full One, it was like on release pages, texting her, telling them I sold the music, right? So they were showing screen recording on my number. I was selling music and shit. So Jen pulled up on me, she was talking, she was like, you selling music? I'm like, nah, what happened? So she showed me the screen recording of my number, selling music, and I'm, I got confused. I'm like, the fuck on my number in this shit, right? So long story short, a couple of days after, I found out it was a relative of mine that was on my phone oh. selling music, right? Cause they have, he had- Oh, okay, I was about to say. He was, I was playing on release for him. I thought he got exposed he phone, by He was sending himself shit for me through Gmail, all that shit. I didn't even know. So boom, he sent himself stuff and he sent it to our release pages for like, I don't know, 15, 20, I don't know how much. They were saying, they were saying $10, but they, the unreleased page saying $20. So I'm just like, how much is he selling it for? You feel me? So it was like $15, $20, I think. And that's when I text him, like, yo, I pulled up on him, like, let me see your phone. So I checked his phone and I found out he was actually doing it. Kyle Rich did an interview with Cam Capone saying this Everybody in 4 1 plays a role. Mm -hmm. For me, you gotta play a role in life for me. And that's how Die trying to step out their lane. If you stay in lane, you're gonna be good. Everybody everybody got their own lane. Mo Cardi's lane was to be the store runner. He, he I'm not gonna lie. That's just so corny. <clears throat> Respectfully, most of the shit I see from the nigga doesn't be mad corny to me. But it's, it's shit like this, like store runner, homie. Come on, be honest. You know that shit got. I ain't even gotta know y'all niggas to know that shit got. Come on. That shit is whack. I ain't gonna lie. Why y'all doing that man like that? Reamers, though. He, 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 he was the football. Was... We need a that for me. <laughs> <laughs> he was like the filling, but I'm gonna keep it a hundred, bro, because I don't want <laughs> think. Well, like for me, he was really on some four one, bro. He not putting no pain on none of that, bro. He was not. He was never on no drills with us on none of that, bro. Nah, he. That's it for today's I'm video. I'm not even gonna make a comment on that. Any rapper. Yeah, I got it. I forgot to put in the video. Also, leave a like. And turn oh, you forgot to put two drill rappers on me. That's what you DK forgot, out. Tino. All right. Fuck. Hey, man. That's what it is, bro. Hey. I ain't got no comments. Uh, you know what I'm saying? We've been bamboozled. Me and you together have been bamboozled. All right. But hey, bro. Hey. A good video otherwise, uh, Tino. Shout out to APK Tino, man. Uh, you know, links in the description getting to him. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. Y'all stay safe, man. Have a good rest of y'all. Day slash night, you know what I'm saying? Y'all take it easy. Get back, back, back. Get back.